Hey everyone, Sam from United People's TV. How are we doing here on a very, very happy Monday morning after Liverpool nil, Man United won, four wins out of four for Van Gaal against Liverpool. Say what you want about him, I fucking love that record. But let's get straight into the MUFC transfer daily back here as we are Monday to Friday with the latest transfer news. We're halfway through January. There's been little to no movement from Man United, but here are the latest rumours. Uh, this first one's a bit of a mad one from a in Portugal saying linking Tony Cruz with some sort of mega, mega money move to Man United. There's more chance of play me playing for Man United than Tony Cruz at any point in the future. If we were going to sign him, it would have been after the World Cup. He went to Real Madrid. Let's move on from that one. I think we can just leave that in the pile to the side. Now, this is probably quite an interesting one uh, from the Daily Mail saying that Man United are prepared to let Andreas Pereira go out on loan. Uh, saying that they've rejected the advances or Le Leicester uh, interested in, in taking him on loan, but seeing as he, they are a genuine contender or opponent for these Champions League spots, United aren't going to let. Well, then United are not going to strengthen an opponent at this at this point of the season. Uh, from my point of view, the concept of letting Pereira out on loan is a little bit similar to Yanez at the start of the season. I'm not sure why we do it. Um, we're not exactly swimming with options up front right now. We're not exactly scoring goals for fun. So why would we let one of our attacking options leave and reduce our options even more? We're going to get hit by injuries again at some point this season. Um, I don't think we should let Pereira go anywhere. I think he's had great progression this year. He's a genuine option from the bench. Why would you take that away from yourself? Let me know in the comments below whether you think the idea of letting Pereira out on loan is a good idea. Uh, moving on, we've got Sadio Mane. Um, ever since those rumours got intense last week, it's all petered down a little bit. He played for Southampton in the FA Cup. He also played at the weekend, uh, played about 60 minutes. Um, nothing really much has happened in the past few days with Mane. As I said, and I still stand by this, I think if we are going to make a signing in January, I see Mane as the most likely option. But United have been as quiet as a mouse in this transfer window. We haven't been linked with anyone really substantially apart from Mane there's not been much movement from the club um will we make a signing uh, let me know in the comments below again what you think on this but the way it's going I don't particularly think so do we need to strengthen yes we could obviously do with some you know a new striker new defender but signing those players in January is difficult uh moving on to the final point I've got is uh Preston boss Simon Grayson so he expects to complete the signing of Liam Grimshaw today. Now, Liam Grimshaw is a R under 21s midfielder, was on loan at Motherwell. Motherwell confirmed that he had been released early from his loan to come back to Man United. And they said that they had been gazumped by an English club who were going to buy him on a permanent deal. Looks like that's Preston. Um, personally, I'm not too surprised. You know, Grimshaw was nominated for the under 21s uh, Player of the Year award last year. But I do feel this is probably the right move for him. And probably the right move for United. I don't think he would have went on to break into the first team. For me, he wasn't one of those players that really stood out. He was a good under-21s player. I think he'd be a good player for Preston. Not as good as Ben Pearson, who I've rated a bit higher. But, you know, it is what it is. United have got a great academy in terms of creating players, whether they play for Man United or not. There's so many players that go on to play for football clubs in England. And it looks like Liam Grimshaw is going to be the next one, and it's going to be at Preston. Uh, that's it for MUFC Transfer Daily today. Let me know in the comments if I've missed any, any rumours you've seen around, anything you'd like me to talk about. Drop me the link in the comments and I'll, I'll talk about it tomorrow, all right? So big thumbs up on the video. That always helps, guys. And subscribe to United People's TV if you're new. It's a shame we can't beat Liverpool 1-0 every weekend, but hopefully we can do the same against Southampton this weekend. And we'll see you tomorrow.